cool cats this is speed delta coming to you with the first cut video of the year my mom chose my blind date truth or drink came out two days ago already got some pretty delicious reception and i'm kind of sad that i missed out on it but hey i'm jumping on it now better than better late than never you know how it is mm -hmm. in any case hope you guys are ready because i'm jumping right into it no hesitation so, spuds up. Let's go. Heck was that? Or will you ever do anal? Have you ever, or will you ever do anal? Ew. Oh. Sorry, mom. Um, I oh no, she's about to say yes. Aw, oh, man. All the women that I've met have hate anal. I have, and I'd do it again. Maybe it's just the people that I know, but all the women that I've met. <laughs> They've not only tried it, but they absolutely despise every second Hello. of it. <laughs> my name's Jade. I'm awaiting my Hi, date Jade. for truth or drink. Um, why are you here today? To, to pick. Because I set her up on a date. Of the people you left out from today's dirt, why did you leave them out? I think the person that I chose Ooh. had a very also, similar there's, interest Also, this is my snack for the day. The people they... Nice, fresh pineapple is my snack for the day. They didn't have as much in common, and I think that was what left them out. What are your top most important things for a partner for Jade? Confident. Integrity. That's huge. And what are your top interests in finding someone? I think someone that's really self-assured. Someone with a good sense of humor. Who did you normally pick? <laughs> oh, people that really need a lot of attention. Someone that's selfish? I feel like I she said she wanted somebody who's selfish. Accepting good things, and so I just need to be more welcoming and open to that. I deserve it. Do you, mm -hmm. do you trust your mom? Oh yeah, one thousand percent, almost more than I trust myself. Hey, eyes closed. Why am I nervous? And I'm not the one on the date. The only one who can see what's going on is mom. Hey, mom. Mm mm. There's the chair right, oh, right there. There you okay. go. Okay. All right, open your eyes. I can't see him yet, but I hope he's cute. Good. How are Cedric. you? I'm Jade. Nice to meet you. Cedric nice and Jade. Like okay. Well, how old are you? I'm Let's see how this goes. I'm 23 as well. Really? Yeah, that's my mother. Hi, Mom. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> she was the one who picked you. Oh, yeah? I did. How does it make you feel? Pretty good. Yeah. I think I have a good chance of it. Man, I would, I would feel so good if somebody's mother picked me to date them, too. Like, you already have that approval off the bat. In fact, you were the one who was suggested. Bro, that, that's got to be such a huge confidence boost. <laughs> Have you ever cheated? No. No? Have you ever thought about it? Yeah. Oh, the person right. I was dating was a little sack of trash. Have you ever cheated? Ooh, I have not. I thought about it, mm -hmm. uh, but I felt it was better just to leave the situation than mm -hmm. to kind of put it in a place where it wasn't going to be good for Always. Us. Okay. So, yeah. What's your favorite search word when looking for porn? I'm going to drink real quick. That's fair. I'm kind of wondering if I should answer the questions too, but these are some pretty, pretty invasive questions right here, like, Jesus. I mean, I've thought about cheating too, but I'm also not in a relationship, so <laughs> doesn't really make much sense, huh? <laughs> like, I had one little committed relationship when I was in middle school, and it I don't even know if that counts, but yeah, it was obviously pretty bad, because we were in middle school. <laughs> I went through all of high school and even my adult years, just not caring. Have you ever, or will you ever do anal? Oh, you guys are being spicy. We just heard the answer to that. Sorry, mom. Um, I have, and I'd do it again. Um, mm. wait, 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 wait. Just gonna breeze on by that. <laughs> what? Yeah. That's wild. It That's is. Wild. Yeah. Multiple times? Uh, just once. And you liked it to the point where you would do it again? I would. Uh huh. Blackout. Yeah, I did. What's your longest relationship? Like two and a half, almost three years. Okay. Wow. What about you? Probably like six months. Why was it not longer? It's um, Jade, yeah. bro. <laughs> that was that sack of trash I was telling you about. Uh, wow. She has not had the best of luck in dating. She has not necessarily picked the winners. Okay. I've actually only dated him, mm. and then mm. I kind of was wiling. And then I stopped whiling, so I've just been, like, really single for, like, two years. That's not bad. <clears throat> what are your vices? That's a good question. 
Do you drink? Smoke weed? Or... I do drink. Not as much as I used to. Oh, wait. I don't... Actually, I can answer those last two questions. A, the fr- no, no backdoor. That just seems like you. That just seems like asking for trouble. Why would anybody want to go in go in a place where there's poop? That just seems gross, bro. That it's it's poop. I don't want to get pooped on, even if it's accidental. That's still disgusting. I've already been barfed on, bled on. I I don't need any. I don't need to be pooped on. That's the last thing that I want to do. But yeah, and my vices. Just eating produce. That's pretty much it. Don't smoke anymore. And potato chips. I haven't had sex in like two years. What about you? I used to smoke more like socially. Mm-hmm. I kind of didn't like how it was. I still I don't do any of the other stuff. Like, like smoking or vaping or drinking. I got no interest. Like, you know, that's pretty much it. Yeah. I mean, no, people often. who do like it, yeah, often. that's fine. I can never date somebody who smokes cigarettes because, like, yeah. But... Not weed. I, I could deal with that. Sure. I could deal with that. But, uh, yeah. How many Personal preference, you, you know. Wait, what was the question? Frick, <laughs> I talk too much. How many partners have you had? I Well, I just answered that question. <laughs> One. If that, if that counts. Kim Sorry, Mom. More than ten. Mmm. Okay. What's your red flag? Oh, they meant I sexual part. <laughs> Never mind. Emotionally, I can just be all over the place. Someone would need some patience with me. I have a lot of patience, mm-hmm. and uh, it could work out. I would say some of my red flags. Bro, it's obvious that these two very actually like each other and want to get to know each other. They're 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 vibing pretty well. My red flag is that I'm completely so so socially inept, which is why I only had one relationship when I was in middle school. And never again. <laughs> is, I could lose interest, Doc. Mm-hmm. I think and that. Red flag too, actually. I, was saying, I, I, was, I was kind of doing the same thing. <laughs> Probably it. How are you feeling so far? Good. I like this whole like experience and everything like that as well. How do you feel like Cedric's sizing up his half boyfriend? They're doing well. A plus compared to that. <laughs> yes. What's more important, your relationship with God or your romantic relationships? My relationship with God. I started um, finding a relationship with God about two years ago, mm-hmm. and it's been a great journey. Uh, what about you? Oh, the same. Yeah? The same. If I'm being real with myself, I can um, get my priorities out of whack. And so, like, hmm. I can go on dates with people. I'm like, I know this ain't it. Yeah. But I want companionship. And so I put that above what I know. Of course. I should. Hmm. That's actually an interesting question. Relationship with God versus romantic relationships. Like, what do you mean? Because on one hand, they could mean, would I choose a person over over my relationship with the Lord? Obviously, no. Duh. Like, <laughs> who the heck would, right? But if, if, if it's like dating somebody who's not a Christian, I could date a Catholic, some, another form of Christian. I don't know if I'd work well with an atheist at all. I just don't feel like the energy, the passion would even be there. So, I mean, maybe there's possibility, but I wouldn't know. I don't date. I haven't. I have not dated people. I do not know how I work with people. So, the answer for me is just no. I'm just going to say no. I could I never. Relationship I with God really all the way. Like, yeah. I like how it's going so far. Oh. Cheers. <laughs> So is that a priority for mom? Is that a priority for you, Jay? For both of us. Yeah, for both of us. For sure. It's been a journey. I've like believed and not believed. And at this point, I'm just kind of figuring out what that looks like for myself. Uh, that's kind of how it was for me as well. Um, <laughs> do you want kids? Mm-hmm. Oh, I do, I do, I mm-hmm. do. How many? Um, Seven. Okay. Eight. Okay. How do you feel about Eight. kids? Uh, I like kids. If I did have kids, I'd probably want about like three of them. Mm-hmm. Eleven. Boys. Mainly, but Thirteen. Like, like a, having a girl would create like a big soft spot. Actually, I want as many kids as it takes to completely overrun the state of Vermont. Yep. Just, just, just take over the whole state. So maybe a few thousand. Face off with your boys? Nah. No. Mm. Why? It's not really like a sex thing where guys have to be like tough and all that, but like you still have to walk with like. Your chest held out, you know what I mean? Mm. 
Wait, what did I miss? You and Face Off with your boys? Nah. No? Why? It's not really like a sex thing where guys have to be like tough and all that, but like you still have to walk with Be confident in you in who you are. Doesn't matter who you are, but come on. Like, I'm gonna just be soft with all of them. But I feel like there's times when you have to assert your dominance. You have to show them like it's not a friendship type of thing. It's still I'm I'm your parent. Right. You're my son. Mm -hmm. That sounds like an ego thing. And I think that's like more old fashioned. And it's not a bad thing. That's just not my thing. For mm, sure. That's fair. Have you ever been arrested? Um, oh, what? No, no way. I haven't. Oh. Okay, I thank goodness. Why? <laughs> My man hesitated for a little bit too long there. Okay. It uh, Even if he almost got arrested for fighting, to be arrested is to be placed in handcuffs and to be taken into custody by the police. That is what an arrest is. No, con not not a conviction, not incarceration, not any of that. That's what an arrest is. I've also never been arrested, so yeah, it's just a straight up yes for me. I ha I don't think I've gotten too close, but I don't even know if there's a temper involved. Yeah, yeah that's, that's what I'm thinking. I'm, I'm like, like, I'm a calm, collected guy. When was the last time you ever fought? Actually, a couple couple weeks ago. You might really? Be going at it sometimes. Sibling fighting is a little different. <laughs> I dare you to kiss me. Okay. I'm sorry, I don't want to kiss you. Okay. Oh, Did okay. You don't kiss me either? I don't like it's just a first type of thing. No, you don't kiss me. Bro, I know I'm gonna sound really down bad for this, but she's got really nice lips. I would actually kiss her if she if the card made me. And she was interested. But Kissing on the first date is already a red flag. Maybe I'm just a red flag. I don't know. On the first date? Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, what did you think? It went well. Mm. I really like your personality. I liked how you answered your questions. Uh, what about you? I had fun. I don't know if I'd go on another date with you. Mm. I think you're really cool. <laughs> I appreciate that. Come on, girl. <laughs> I think your thoughts on parenting are interesting. Doesn't really align with what I'd like. And then your fighting kind of scares me. Mmm. Mm. Makes sense. Yeah. I mean, things happen for a reason. Like, you're so cool person. Yeah. But you gotta have that difference in parenting or else the relationship won't be balanced. It'll be too one-sided if you have two people who, are, who have the same parenting style. But then again, like I said, everybody has their preferences. And apparently she was... Yeah, she... They did... They, I mean, look what happened after they talk about parenting. They, it was really awkward for a little bit. Like, I don't know. I guess it makes sense. Sometimes when you have to assert your dominance, you have See? to show them, like, like she looked at her <laughs> him like, it's still, I'm, I'm your parent. Right. You're my son. I mean, that sounds like an ego thing. And then they just got off on the wrong like, foot, and then fashion. it's like, and it's not after she stopped thing, talking, listen to this. Sure. Yeah, just just that awkward silence where neither or, or they, one of them was putting on a kind of fake smile, the other one just stopped smiling altogether. I think that's the point where it just went bad. I mean, on the, on the same level though, you can't just judge somebody based on the first dates. But you know, it's she is who she is. It's her. It's obviously her choice. I. But. It does kind of stink, because these two, they seem like they worked really well at the beginning, and I, and I really wanted them to work out. But, you know, it is what it is. Rose and Cedric, not, not a couple. <sighs> Dang, cut. You guys are starting off on a, on a, pretty, on a pretty sour note. <laughs> okay, let me stop. In any case, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, like and subscribe. Obviously, check out the cut. They, they're the ones who do the button and all these other cool videos. Like, everybody reacts to them. And by everybody, I mean a lot of people who like, like, reality TV and such. So, I'd say definitely check them out if you haven't already. Because if you haven't already, then what are you doing? In any case, this potato's out. Peace.